Hello, family of God. This is Vicki and Chuck. Thank you for joining us today here at Vineyard Tabernacle. It is a blessing, as always, to have you with us. And thank you if you're new. We hope that uh, these daily podcasts are a blessing to you. Where We appreciate that you've come to check us out. Okay, today, you guys, I'm going to read uh, the 20th Psalm, and I'm reading from the New King James Version, I believe. Yes. Okay, so here we go, Father. Thank you. May the Lord answer you in the day of trouble. May the name of the God of Jacob defend you. May he send you help from the sanctuary and strengthen you out of Zion. May he remember all your offerings and accept your burnt sacrifice. Selah. May he grant you according to your heart's desire and fulfill all your purpose. We will rejoice in your salvation, and in the name of our God, we will set up our banners. May the Lord fulfill all your petitions. Now, I know that the Lord saves his anointed. He will answer him from his holy heaven with the saving strength of his right hand. Some trust in chariots and some in horses, but we will remember the name of the Lord our God. They have bowed and fall, bowed down and fallen, but we have risen and stand upright. Save, Lord. May the King answer us when we call. Father, we thank you because we do believe you answer us when we call. We believe that you answer us in so many different ways. Sometimes your answer is yes. Sometimes your answer is no. Sometimes your answer is that you are silent because you you're doing some things we can't see, but God, the thing we know always is that you are good. And every decision you make, every response you give or don't give is because of the goodness of who you are, because of your great wisdom. We do rejoice in, in the things that you have already shown us about who you are, the almighty God, the King the maker of heaven and earth, the creator of all things. Father, we thank you and praise you for all that you're doing in the lives of your people now. And we thank you and praise you for all that you've ever done in our lives, for how you have been so faithful to bring us to this point. But we realize our journey is not finished. We still have much to learn, much to do, much growing yet ahead of us. And so, Father, we thank you for your precious gift of patience with us. We pray for the ones who don't know you yet. May they come to know that you are the creator. And Father, we pray that hearts would be changed, lives would be touched, and that as your people, we would not be afraid to open our mouths and tell people about the glorious creator of all. We thank you, God, for this time and for those who come to listen and come to spend time with us here in this little corner of your vineyard. We thank you, Father, for the work you're doing in the earth. We thank you for the days that are ahead. We thank you for the strengthening that you bring to each one of your people as we seek you daily, pursuing your heart. Father, I pray for all of us. Wherever we need to die to self, if there's still something in us that is uh, has risen itself up and, and exalted itself above the knowledge of God, Father, show us, help us see what we need to see about ourselves so that we truly are completely available to you in every way so that we can worship and praise and adore you in all the ways you want to be worshiped and praised and adored, that our lives are truly laid down and that we no longer seek our own will, but only the will of our Father God in heaven. We bless your name this day, Father, and we pray for all of those you're calling that don't know you yet, as well as the ones who know you that have walked away. We pray for your animals. We pray for your creation, Lord, those things the enemy is trying to destroy. God, we pray for your protection and for only your will to be done. Thank you, Father, for your tremendous love. Thank you, Father, for your generosity, for your goodness in all things at all times. You are good. We bless your name this day in the name of our Savior, Yeshua, the Messiah, Jesus the Christ, the Word of God, one of my favorite names for our Savior, Lord, the Word. 
the Word. In the beginning was the Word. The Word was with God, and the Word was God. Thank you, Lord, in your precious name. Amen. Guys, don't forget tomorrow, I'm going to play some of Chuck's music uh, in a moment, but I just want to remind you tomorrow, if you have time and you're interested, uh, at 5 o'clock Central, Judy and Nicole will be doing the uh, weekly, I keep wanting to call it something else, Temple Keepers Food for Thought. So if you're interested, you might want to jump on there and, and join them. It's a Zoom call and it will be uh, the link will be posted tomorrow you can look in you can look even in this in this podcast just go down into the description and you can find uh, the zoom for Wednesdays for food for thought for temple keepers okay guys we love you very much don't forget also Friday is uh, zoom with me and oh We have amazing times. Please join us if you are available and you're interested. We would love to see you there in the conversation. May the Lord continue to bless and keep you and may your heart be so full of desire to please him that nothing else satisfies. In Yeshua's name, amen. Now here comes Chuck.